Okay. All right, I ask you, attendance is very important. We happen to have had over 100,000 people outside of COVID and outside of a game that they ignore against Northwestern where the weather was really bad. 100,000 people in the big house since 1975. Okay, that's basically my lifetime. Do you think it will continue? Discuss 20 years, 30 years, 40 years, do you think people will physically be watching football games in Michigan Stadium way out into the future? Discuss amongst your friends. And don't forget why. Why do you think if you do or don't? Oh my God. You're the best. Oh, you are. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you like it. Are you sticking around? No. Oh. All right. Can I say something about your request? you mind? Yeah. Hey, guys. These guys got to go. Um, I do want to acknowledge someone else. Uh, does anyone know Shelly Kovacs or have heard that name before? OK. Yeah. A lot of people know this woman. Um, the, she is, now I, I gave a lot of credits for John Bacon. He's a mentor, he helped me, and he created this class. But I have to thank this woman, who's not only been special to me, special to my kids, but thousands and thousands and thousands of students and student athletes here at Michigan have been counseled, advised, some would say saved by this woman. And if there's any reason if you enjoy anything about your scene right here, um, it's because of this woman. She's the woman who got me here at Michigan. Can I get a big round of applause for Shelly Kovacs? All right. Jill, thank you. All right, the jug is safe for a couple more years. Okay, discuss. Hey, and by the way, why? You guys ready? You guys ready? Okay. Who, th who doesn't think, you know, who, th who does not think it's going to be the same Okay, some of you will have kids 20, 30 years from now. Are they going to go to Michigan Stadium? What do you think? And give, someone give me, does anyone think no? Does anyone think maybe not? Why not? It's going to be on Meta. Go Zuck. Zuck is breaking. I thought you guys, okay. <laughs> it's going to be on Meta. It's going to be in the Metaverse, yes. Okay, so the bacon, kids have been replaced with clients. People are getting pushed out. It is getting more and more expensive. We don't know with revenue sharing whether how much of that is going to be on the ticket holders, et cetera. Okay, anybody else? Anyone? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. What's up? Me and Paul actually talked about uh, exactly what you put on the screen, the bar in Texas that watched the game. We thought yeah. that was the most adjacent experiences to watch the game will also pop up. What is the idea of the way in person viewing, but also be in a way like maybe the and other things like that? Double decker bar, maybe triple decker. Um, I don't, you know, I think it's a Texas bar, but that, that's nice. They put a Michigan thing. A virtual experience. So all of you who said camaraderie with my buds, we got to cheer, we get the environment together. These guys drove, well, it's Texas, so they drove 100 miles to come here, but whatever. They, they drove, it's got bathrooms, bar, parking, and it looks like they're having a damn good time. That's pretty good. This, is, this was this game. OK, so I'm split. I'm split. Who thinks, yeah, Dooley, that's just more. That's just another way to watch it. 
I think you can make that argument. So what do you guys think? What do you think? Are people going to go to the big house? What do you think? Why? I think, yeah, because obviously there's college students here that go every year, and they still come here, and their family, and like, it's a tradition for a lot of people to come okay. every year. And You're assuming students are going to be here on campus. Yeah. OK. I think that has a time frame. Yeah. Well, I know we're investing a lot in all these buildings and stuff. Yeah. What do you think? To physically be there. Yeah. yeah. Um, uh, how many of you, it's OK, let's hear it. I'd say it was about 2 thirds of you left, did not witness one snap inside the big house inside the third quarter. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Right? OK. You didn't miss it that much. You went home and got your precious pizza or whatever. OK, took off. All right, Who th who's very strongly, yeah, they'll be there 20, 30 years. Yeah, yeah, you think so. You guys are going to want to come back and go to the big house, right? You guys are going to want to be there. You're going to want to relive that moment. OK, yeah. You'll want to bring your kids. Yeah, probably. This is pretty dope, though. This is pretty dope. You got all your buds. You got your whole crew from back in your college days. Bathrooms. Come on. Parking. What's up? Gets more important when you're older. Yeah. I mean, I feel like if the trend continues, at least for vacay, people will be there. Because like, I would not do this instead of trying to get a ticket to be in the big house when we beat Ohio State and get to rush the field like I did last year. Right. Like, you can't do that from a bumper. Yes, this is cool, but. You cannot rush the field in a bar. That's right. All right. What, what do you got? Your standard of action to that, so that will eventually be like watching an Apple on a TV. Like uh, Apple's new headset, they are not reaching the demand they thought Okay. So I think like the novelty in the stadium is just like. Yeah, it's a novelty. Guys, there are threats. This is one of them. I'm telling you. I wonder how long students need to be. I know there's a, there's a back to work, back to the office trend, but I don't know that you all need to be here. I'm not saying my class. Clearly, I want you to be here. I want you to show up. But you guys get what I'm saying. I'm not sure you all have to physically be here to get the same experience in the classroom. But I think most of you understand this is bigger than that. And I think the games are bigger than that. I hope it continues. I also wish they made paper tickets. You guys don't care about that. They're easy to transfer to people. You do care. It would be easier to sell sometimes, wouldn't it? To just hands, I don't know. OK, it is a cool keepsake. All right, we'll talk about this, because it's, oh my god, you just got in my craw. <laughs> <laughs>